Hello Tubers, I'm going to do an unboxing of a wonderful camera that I've heard a lot of great things about and it's called the Canon PowerShot SX40HS. Um, the reason I bought it is because a few years ago I spent quite a bit of money on a uh, Canon Vixia HF200 um, when it came out. So between the memory cards, accessories and uh, what I paid for the body filters, uh, I paid a lot of money for this thing. But I've I've made a lot of money with this camera too, but great camera, it's malfunctioning, I can't rely on it anymore. So I've heard amazing things. This SX40HS is the closest thing you can get to a uh, digital DSLR. Now um, I, I shoot on a Canon T3i for some of my professional work, which uh, some of it gets in my YouTube stuff, some of it doesn't, but um, I think I can use a camera like this to do a lot of versatile things for YouTube and uh, I paid uh, 349 here in uh, the Vancouver area so we're gonna go through the unboxing uh, do a few test shots and we're gonna see what it looks like so there we go I'll let you know let's do the unboxing here we go Okay, first off, we got our Canon warranty information. Typical Canon uh, digital solution disc. Um, I don't know if that's really relevant or important. Um, next, we have the uh, guide en français, très bien, uh, mais oui, for, for the French people, <laughs> français, uh, mais oui. So, uh, rest assured. Québécois, you can uh, use the, the camera with no problem. Um, we've got a micro to a regular USB adapter here, so you can plug the camera in. Um, we've got that typical proprietary uh, Canon charger system where you got to put the. Uh, they don't they don't let you use regular batteries. You you have a regular charger that. Uh, you have to use with Canon. You get the Canon strap. Everybody gets a Canon strap. Um, the other fasteners and the Canon battery, of course. And for the uh, the moment we've all been waiting, the actual body of the camera. Here we go. So here it is. Let's take the lens cap off. There we go. Nice, uh, fairly big lens for a camera of this uh, price point. Um, the best part that I love about this is the rotating uh, viewer screen. Now, if you're a YouTuber like me and you use this professionally to for your YouTube channels, when you're shooting yourself, trying to make sure you're in frame. If you're going to do it by yourself, you need to see yourself, so you need a monitor. Or Now this, this completely makes the, the whole thing possible, because you can see if you're in the frame, you can shoot it. Now, I've heard a lot of great things about the zoom on this. It's got, I think, a, well, it says 35 times optical zoom. I've heard that, I don't know, some models are 40, but 35 optical is quite impressive for a camera of this price point. And, um, since I shoot on Canon exclusively, I'm always concerned about white balance problems. So the processor and the optics will be Canon, so I won't have white balance problems. So that's the, the main reason I moved to this. It's got a uh, image stabilizer um, built in. Uh, uh, I think it's an amazing camera. Now I have not shot anything with it yet. I'm going to put an SD card in it, grab a tripod, and I'm going to shoot something for you guys, and you guys can see and you can decide for yourself. Um, like I said, 349 Canadian, I bought it at Future Shop here in the lower mainland area of Vancouver, British Columbia. Um, I've seen it online as low as $300 US in a few parts of the United States with online retailers. So um, let's see how it compares.
Now it's near sunset, but I'm um, shooting this footage right here on the uh, SX40. Um, I think it's not too bad. I, I can't wait to actually look at the raw footage, but anyway, um, this is uh, all shot on the SX40. Uh, not too bad, I think. Pretty good camera for the money. I'd highly recommend it. So, two thumbs up. Cheers from Canada.